Hey, what's up guys? I am here in my kitchen. I wanted to tell you all a little bit about alkaline water and why it's important to keep your pH level high. First of all, cancer, diseases, all that great stuff, it can't survive in an alkaline environment where there's plenty of oxygen. So what, what I've done here is, boom, that's an alkaline filter right there, purifier. And it goes in one of these pitchers like this thing right here, right here. Mix it with some, uh, I got some aloe vera in there too, actually. And this water is so, so, so good. First of all, it tastes great. You can tell the difference. And it will hydrate you five times faster than most water. For instance, in your tap water, this water right here contains neurotoxins like chlorine and sodium fluoride. So which sodium fluoride is in your toothpaste. Stop using that toothpaste because that calcifies your pineal gland, which is terrible for you. Um, I'll make a video about your pineal gland, but it's basically what you use to think. So imagine it's a neurotoxin, basically. So by drinking alkaline water, you're decalcifying your pineal gland and you're preventing cancer. Oh, oh, that's so good. So, there are a couple ways to alkaline your water or to purify it. Um, you can add you can add apple cider vinegar, and I'll show you. Bragg's is the best brand. Let me show you. Right here. <clears throat> I actually take baths in this stuff. I bathe in pure alkaline water because you still absorb fluoride through taking showers and stuff like that. So, um, here it is. Boom. Bragg organic apple cider vinegar. It has to be organic. Give it a shake. Put about a tablespoon in each glass of water. Or put, you know, a couple ounces in a pitcher. Purifies all of it. Or you can take a lemon with some Himalayan salt, which you know I have plenty of. There's my lamp right over there. And put that inside your water. And that will and uh, put it in a jar and let it sit out for about 12 hours to 14 hours at room temperature. Hey, bitty squirrels, get out of there. Hey, hey, bitty squirrels. No, no. Get out, get out, get out, get out. You can't be in James' room. Get out of here. Get out, get out. <laughs> and uh, put that in your water, let it sit for room temperature for a few hours, and uh, that will also alkalize your water. Now the filter that I have over here, what it does is adds all kinds of cool nutrients to it. Let's see. The Enviro product alkaline pitcher filter replaces cartridges, raises pH to 8.5 to 9.5 by adding the perfect balance of neutrally, sorry, naturally ionized magnesium, potassium, calcium, and sodium. So by adding these natural nutrients to your water, it will alkalize it, thus uh, reversing the effects of fluoride and all these terrible neurotoxins that they put in our water. You know, Hitler actually used sodium fluoride in tap water for his slaves to keep them submissive and docile. And it's doing the same thing to you whether you know it or not. And your pineal gland is how you see your thoughts. It's how you manifest and you, rem you remember your dreams and all these amazing abilities that we have, basically our godlike abilities what gives us psychic-like abilities to use telepathy and all that great stuff comes from our pineal gland, which is the center of your brain, the third eye, whatever you want to call it. And that destroys it. And our government's doing it on purpose, in case you didn't know this already. So, alkalize your water, change your toothpaste, uh, start bathing in it. I would recommend it. I mean, it's kind of uh, extreme for some people. But honestly, it's it's the best way to do it. It's a way to get out there and avoid it. Also, you can get well water. If you do get well water, make sure the well water is about 200. Your well is about 200 feet deep because 50 foot deep is not deep enough, I've been told. And there's a lot that goes into that. I'm not 100% sure on that. I haven't been trained on it. But um, drink alkaline water. Super good for you. Eat alkaline foods that are full of water like cucumbers. And there's a whole whole lot of alkaline foods you can you can check out and uh, it's gonna change your life the reason why most of us feel uncomfortable in our bodies 
that is because of a state of acidity. So if we reverse that by changing our body to alkaline, we'll feel a lot better. So much love, guys. Namaste.